All right. Uh, I'm not metal detecting right now, but I, I have been off for a week, and uh, our doggy had puppies. There's 11 of them. Uh, three are black labs, and the rest of them are chocolate labs. Pretty cool. But anyways, I, my it's actually my sister's dog, so uh, I watched these puppies for seven days while they went on a cruise. So I had to miss seven days of metal detecting. Well, I don't go every day, but almost every day. I try. <laughs> anyways, I'll be back at it again, and today I'm going back at it. So hopefully something else won't come up because it seems like Something's always coming up. Anyways, puppies. Pretty cute. And I just noticed they're starting to open their eyes. I think it was that big fat one there. Yeah, oh yeah, that was, his eyes are open. I don't know if you can see that camera. Just today. So pretty cool, sunshine. Good job. We got some pretty cute babies there. All right, I'm out here at a new spot. And, uh... I was just digging some junk and stuff, and I, I got a signal, and it was a buffalo nickel. So I'll show some live digs now. Since this is a new stabat, I didn't want to do it live, uh, because I wasn't sure if it would even be a coin. They said this isn't even where the coins are, where I found this. So hopefully we'll find more over here. I'm going to get back at it. Uh, here's a 12. And I just dug that nickel right by here, so this should be a nickel. Could be, I mean. I mean, it's, got, it's like the perfect sound. But 12 might not be the perfect sound, I don't know. Oh, where is it? All right, let's do the old foot trick. That always works for me. Oh, another buffalo. Yeah, buffalo. <laughs> another buffalo. <laughs> it wasn't that deep. All right, going back at it. Well, I almost forgot to turn my camera on on this one. Let's see here. Sounds good. Let's see what it is without bending over. 25 or something, 21? Yeah, like the 20s for sure. There it is, there it is, right there. Right there. Oh, nice. yep. It looks like a weedy, I can see it from there. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Nice. Uh, yeah. Wow, look at it. It's got some shine to it, even. Huh. I must have hit it. Flip it over to see the date. Let's see the date. It's a 46. Nice. 1946. All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> They're over here. All right, we got to get back to the detective. We're going to have to change the name to... Uh... <laughs> All right, here's a 20, 19, 18, 20. Well, normally it would be a penny, but this really doesn't sound that great. 
but you never know, so I'm going to go ahead and dig it. Could just be deep. Should be in the scoop. No. Nope. It's a nice solid 20. But most of the Wheaties have been ringing up a little higher than that. All right, here we go. We got it. Be nice to find a little piece of dirt. Hey, right here. It's a nice sound. Ah, oh, I see it. And guess what? It's another shotgun shell. These detectors, they don't lie. It's like you knew it wasn't a penny. I mean a weedy because it didn't ring up right. Just by a couple of numbers. It's crazy. So I'm going to keep going. Okay, we got a solid nickel. 13. No doubt about it. I mean, it could not be a nickel, but this... The sound is right, and the number is perfect. Let's see. Although it is kind of deep for how loud it is. I think I got it. There it is, I see it. I see it. And, oh, that's just a regular nickel. It looks old though. Wait, is there an S on the back? No. Uh, 19, looks like 40. Is that true? Wow, I didn't know that that old of a nickel. <laughs> 1940. 1940 nickel! Uh, oh, I have no idea what this could be. 15, 14, 16, but it's a super clear sound. I thought just in case I should dig it live. Yeah, that's kind of mixed up sound. Now it's ringing up his 20. I think it's just a piece of trash. Oh no, this is weird. There it is. Oh, there it is. <laughs> some kind of big piece of metal. Looks like some kind of fence post or something. But there's not much trash up here. Uh, keep going. There's still another sound in there, though. I know they're not. I was just hitting that sound. This one's ringing as a wheat penny. Yeah. Sometimes I miss the the shot because my coil is so big. This should be a weedy. I don't know if I said that already. Solid, solid weedy sound. Jeez. Oh, there it is. Dang. That was a tough one. Well, let's see what it is. I know it's a weedy. Yep. It's a weedy. The date. Looks like 27, but I don't know. 
I'm actually in a different area now, and I already got a signal. 25, 24. That's what Wheaties have been ringing up as. So let's see what it is. I see it. Oh yeah. Weedy! Weedy! <laughs> I gotta turn the camera. I think I just got another one, but it, it's only ringing up as 20. Maybe it is a shotgun shell, I don't know. No, it's definitely a penny. Uh, I think I scraped it with my shovel. Darn it. What the heck? Oh, it's an Indian head. Indian head! <laughs> Got another one here. Bringing up as a weedy. This one's a little trapped in there. Well, that's kind of cool to know that an Indian head rings up as 20. Oh, uh, no, I'm talking to my camera. <laughs> this one is probably a weedy. Uh, because it's ringing up as 23. Yep, it is a weedy. Weedy! I know. <laughs> I already caught my limit. All right, here's somebody's dig mark. But look at this. That sounds like a coin to me. But it's probably just junk since somebody already dug it. Oh yeah, that's not ringing up right now. It's kind of jumpy. Loud signal, but it's real jumpy. I think I would have saw it by now. What the heck? Maybe it's still on the ground. Oh, it's a can. <laughs> Well, I'm kind of just plowing through these mustard plants, but I got a signal. So it should be a penny, a weedy. See if we can get this out of here. I do not see it, but it's in here. Thank you. It's about time to pull out my pin pointer. <laughs> oh, I got it. Good. There it is. Ooh, look at that one. A little green, but uh, it's a uh, weedy. I don't know the date. We'll check that later. All right, that's good. Now I know there's more coins over here. 
So I, I'm like on the side of a mountain here. There's like a. I thought I was gonna fall in there, but uh, of course I saw it. But I mean, I'm at the top of the mountain. All right, I'm still chopping through this stuff, and I got a perfect 13. So that should be a nickel. The ground's really hard, so maybe it's not deep. Oh, that's deep. Deeper. I think it's back here more. Alright, we got it. Let's see what it is. Pretty sure it's a nickel. Let's see. Well, I don't know now. Yeah, it's still perfect 13. Ah, my shovel's getting stuck in all this stuff. <laughs> all right. We got it. I don't see any trash. I see it. I see it. What is it? It's a V nickel. Yay. And I cannot see the date. We'll check it later. I think that's a V nickel, yeah. V nickel! <laughs> Alright, I'm getting wore out because I'm going through these bushes. But there's another wheat, wheat panning sound. This is a, what they call mustard. I don't know if you actually make mustard out of it. But here in California, they're just weeds. I mean, they're pretty because they're all yellow, but I think I got it. Actually, I'm going to take it out here, throw it down over here. Scoop it up. Oh, there it is. Wheat penny. All right, I need to find some silver now. <laughs> I think Larry got silver. Sweetie! I haven't found one for a while, but here's a 20. 21. And last time that was like an Indian head, so. Hoping it's another one. Well, it wasn't very deep. Ah, see it. Sometimes it's just take a little patience and look for it and you'll find it. Let's see. No, nope, it's a, a wheat back. Ah, I hit it. Unless that was there, but I think I hit it. <laughs> Looks like it scraped right across it. Darn it. Oh, nice. Wow. They're finding some silver up on the other part of this level here. Two quarters and two half, one half dollar. So we'll check those out later. Ah, there it is. This is a wheat penny. Yep. 1940 something, 41 probably. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just gonna check all the dates when I get home when I do the wrap up and uh, we'll see. Whew. I think I'm done taping. I don't know, let's say I get a real good signal. It's kind of mixed up though, it's jumping around. There's a stranger over there. <laughs> It's kind of jumping around. Oh, let's see. Could be silver. Could be junk. Oh, yeah. It's a can. Okay, I'm at home now. And this is actually my second try of um, doing this uh, wrap-up video. 
I went to upload everything and I lost half of my half of my shots so I don't know what happened but uh here we go we got at least the wrap up I didn't get much I had taped a lot when I was out there and uh, I left the camera on a few times because so I haven't been taping for a while so I just like would forget it's on anyways uh, we got two Indian heads and they were both 1907 on the wheat paintings we got a 1953 a 1941 the 1953 is a D 1937 a 1918 a 1946 a 1910 and a 1910 a 1911 and a 1911 we got a 1940 nickel a regular nickel we got two V nickels uh, 1911 and 1912 we got two buffalo uh, zero date zero date uh, so all together it was nine wheat pennies, two Indian heads, one regular nickel, 1940 though, that's pretty old, two V nickels, and two buffalo. We got a little bit of trash here and there, got a ball for my dog, and the dog was the reason I haven't been out lately, but uh, I'm just dying to get back down to the beach, and uh, they, some guys invited me to go here today so I just said I'm gonna do it they had just found the spot but in the end we got ran out of there by some neighbor or somebody some guy was like he was so angry it wasn't even his property I could tell he never actually said it was his property it's just like steam coming out of his head he was so angry it was like get out of here what are you doing and leave everything you found and this and that and uh this is trespassing blah 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 well there was no sign saying trespassing or anything um so yeah we just left we didn't want to cause any trouble i mean if you would have called the cops we said what do you we could have said you're trespassing too you're here <laughs> anyways uh, i'll catch you guys in the next one and it should be at the beach